What's up agents, it's Chase and J. Miles, and this video has been a long time coming. I am going to actually share with you the amount of money that I made my first year in real estate. And I'm not doing this video to brag because there is nothing to brag about with these numbers, but I'm doing it to really set a realistic expectation. Now, before I get into my actual numbers, keep in mind, I had just moved from across the country into a new city and I thought that it was going to be a great idea starting real estate in this city because this market was just booming and everybody was saying that it was a great place to be. I did not think about I actually had to know people and I had to know the streets and I just I just didn't take a lot of things into consideration. I was very young and yeah, it, it, it was a sad story. And so when I tell you these numbers, don't think that I'm a failure or anything because God has been good. I've been very, very, very blessed and I've learned a lot along the way. That's honestly why I started that first 31 program because there's so much that goes unsaid that people just don't tell you of not just how to get into the business, but but how to work the business and the things that you need to do to become successful in this business. So once I figured those out, things changed. So I'm going to actually tell you my real numbers. I'm gonna show you the numbers. And, and, and yeah, so this video is again about my very first year in real estate and the amount of money that I made. Go ahead, click the subscribe button if you are into learning about real estate and into getting tips to build your business, to get into business, all that type of stuff because that's what I do here. So let's go ahead and get into it. Alright, so I first became licensed in May or April or May of 2013. So 2013 was when I first got my license and I went and joined Keller Williams. I recorded a whole video about why I left Keller Williams, what I liked about Keller Williams. You can watch that. I'll put a link in the cards and stuff, but I joined Keller Williams and I joined one Keller Williams office and um, I ended up leaving that Keller Williams office and going to another Keller Williams office. So at this second Keller Williams office was the first deal that I closed. This deal was the deal that I talked about in that my first listing video. And so you can watch that video, but here's the CDA and what CDA is, it's your commission disbursement authorization whenever you close a transaction or you're about to close a transaction your office sends this out to whoever needs to, to pay you so you can you can see the Keller Williams logo up there I, I blocked out a lot of stuff like sensitive information people's names and stuff like that but the sales price of the property was a hundred and nine thousand I'm gonna zoom in on these numbers so you can see the sales price was a hundred and nine thousand and then the commission on it was three thousand two hundred and seventy dollars this transaction closed March the 6th 2014 so almost a whole year later from when I got into the real estate business that's just how it was for me y'all and I mean I'm not ashamed to say it because um, God has brought me a very long way but this 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 was almost a whole year so I know I showed you that commission amount now if you look next to my name the amount that I actually brought where is it at so so you can see my name and then if we scroll over there that's the amount that I was able to get one thousand eight hundred and eighty two dollars and fifty two cents after a whole year so that three thousand two hundred seventy dollars three hundred twenty seven of it had to be paid to my mentor so the person who was supposed to be helping me and so they got three hundred twenty seven dollars for um, I'm not quite sure what they what they did or what they helped me because I, I I feel like I remember putting up a fight about that but I signed an agreement around it and then the office got a little over a thousand dollars too now, the only thing about this was, I believe that I was on like a 70 or 75 split. And so out of all that commission, they had so many like fees and stuff on top of that that they took out of there. But anyways, a whole year to make a little less than $2,000. That was my first transaction. Now my second transaction, I ended up leaving that, that firm and I went to another one. So here's my second one, it looks a little different than the one before. So my second one was 
done in May of 2014, so May the 15th, so pretty much exactly a year later. I did my second transaction, I was at a different firm. This one was for 115,000. I took home $2,750. So literally, you can see that these properties were pretty close in sales price, but I took uh, home significantly more from that firm. So the good thing about this though is that these were like a month apart and so I was really getting my momentum going and hopefully, um, but then I didn't sell anything for a while. Things kept falling out. So one of my last transactions of the year, and this is the CDA for that one, it was a property that was, where's the sales price? Oh, 207,000 and I was able to take home $4,072. If my calculations serve me correctly, my first year, and I'm, at this point I'm just counting my first year as when I actually started doing transactions, so not really my first year of being licensed, but when my first transaction started to the end of that year, I brought home a little less than $9,000. And that was the truth of my kind of first year in real estate. So. Again, I didn't know a lot and I had to learn a lot. And honestly, this is before any taxes, expenses, like all that kind of stuff. So you can kind of say that I was in the hole, but that's honestly why I started recording these videos. And that's honestly why I started creating these programs. And that's honestly why I continue to do this because there is so much that people just don't say. And I feel like if someone just would have took the time out to do what I'm doing, it probably wouldn't have been almost two years in the game with making less than $9,000. So go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you appreciated me doing this. Leave me a note down in the comments kind of what you're experiencing maybe in your first year of real estate or what your first year was like. And then as always, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Share this video with someone who may need to be inspired or who may need to hear this because trust me, it, 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 it went up from there, like, I mean, it just exploded. And so, I'll tell you how in the future, how I made it kind of explode, but that was my true heart first year right there. I mean, it's in, it's, it's in the documentation, like these are legit forms that I found in my email and printed. So have a great day and I will talk to you soon.